Hoy mga bayaw, kamusta ba ang inyong religious feelings? <laughs> Kilala sa talas ng dila at makikwela mga protesta at pagpapahayag ng sentimiento. Siya na yata ang pinakamatunog at pinakakontrobersyal na aktivisang kultural sa kasalukuyan. Kaya bago po man siya magsimulang magtika ang ngayong Semana Santa, mga bayaw, paingan natin ang mga salaubin ni Carlos Damaso Seldran. Mga kapatid, welcome po sa isang episode ng Wasak na hindi po mga ka-offend ng inyong religious feelings. Magandang gabi po. Ako po si Lord De Vera. Yun po si Jun Sabayton. At ito po ang nag-iisang Carlos Celdran. Yan. Welcome po sa Wasak. Finally, nakuha na rin natin. Carlos, maraming salamat sa oras mo. Apil na lang tayo. Yeah. <laughs> Jun, alam mo ba ang pinagkakabala ng mamang ito ngayon? Is to lose 20 pounds in 3 oh, months. Oh, oh. Oh. Nasusundan ko yung ano niya sa Instagram. Oh. Oh. Eh, yan ang pinaka-importante oh. endeavor sa lahat. At higit sa lahat. Ang premyo mm. ay isang buong lechon. Yun. Yes, kung masing progress ang ginagawa. I, I think I'm going to win. Um, competing against uh, JJ Yulo. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if he's still in the competition. Jim Lee Biran. Ay, si naku, wala, wala na pag-asa yun. <laughs> Tatalo ko na tayo doon. Si, uh, the, the only people really in competition is me and Gabe Mercado. Uh -huh. But Gabe Mercado just went to Hong Kong for a gig. Ay, wala na. Ay, wala na, wala na, wala na. Ang sarap ang pagkakaroon doon. Eh. <laughs> si Jim, tuloy-tuloy pa lang si Jim. <laughs> Sabotage. Sabotage. <laughs> Nagko-crossfit ka. Alam ko, crossfit, ginagawa ng mga, parang mga marines ang gumagawa mm. niya. Talaga, it's intense punishment. It's intense. 20, pero maganda para sa mga walang mm. attention span. Yun ang point, eh. walang pahinga in between, di ba? In between wala, Hindi siya kung ano yung ginagawa ni Jim. Ay, kailangan kayo sama sa ano. They have to do it also with a, what's called a bat paleo diet. Ah, oo. So, walang kani, oo. Oh. Oh, parang caveman yung mm, pagkaya mo. Caveman. Puro karne, puro mm -hmm. dahon, puro. Mm. Just imagine being a uh, caveman. Kamusta yun? Dinosaur. Mm. You know? How do you find the paleo diet? Gusto mo ba siya? I, I'm not quite doing the paleo diet. I'm doing my own diet. Pero walang ano. Mm. Walang walang rice. Plants and animals. I have Tapos. to keep. I have to keep my abs. I have to keep. Mm. I, have to, I have to keep my. Because mm. you know, tuna na lalaki walang abs. Iyon iyon. Oh. So far ba may nakasulubong ka ngayon na hinuusgahan ka na bigla. Mm. Ikaw yung, yung mga... satanista. Iyan no. Oh. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Isang. It hasn't died down, Carlos. Ah uh, no, it's died down na. It's mm. died down na. Mm. Um, when is for when I first did it in 2010, my death threats ako. Mm -hmm. but, but by a cell phone. Mm -hmm. Ang tanga mo naman. By a cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give you a death threat by a cell phone. Yeah. Uh, you're just too stupid. Mm. Um, you're gonna die. Tas, yeah. ano, yung parang smiley. Okay. Mm. And then I remember there's one when the RH bill passed. Yung araw na yon, December 21 mm -hmm. or December 22 when it became mm -hmm. law. Mm -hmm. There's one matrona na taga... Alabang. Talagang halatang taga-alabang. Mm. She was in a big car and everything mm -hmm. like that. She goes up to me and she tells me, soon you'll see the truth. And she starts backing up. <laughs> soon Grabe you'll see no? the truth. Mm -hmm. Carlos, nung pumasay Work RH bill, ano naramdaman mo? Relief. Mm -hmm. um, and... Did you feel that it's all over? Okay na? Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. Over. Over. Pff. Over. Mm -hmm. Done. Mm -hmm. Mission mm -hmm. accomplished. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Divorce na <ba? laughs> Wag naman. Wag naman. I mean, I, I don't want to get into, I mean, there's nothing anymore that will create more polarization. And I, you know, I mean, I don't want my name on the pulpit anymore. Pero teka mo na. I mean, it's flattering to be mentioned in a negative light by the Catholic bishops. In the same way na Satan. Yeah, but you know, it gets kind of tiring after a while. Pero mukhang ngayon pa lang natin nararamdaman yung uh, revenge ng Catholic Church. Kasi na dyan. At nag-react ka sa iyong social media, ano, mm. nasa isang mga social media mm. outlets, ano, yung team buhay, team patay, parang, mm. oh, come on. My <laughs> Pikon. Mm -hmm. mm. Pikon lang yon You can't blame them. I mean, I'm not going to kick a dog when it's down. No, halata, halata. <laughs> mm. You just called the church a dog. <laughs> and not only a dog, but a down dog. Mm. Um, <laughs> but they're having a they're having really bad trip moment. I mean, mm. look at them. Mm. The Pope resigned. Yep. Mm. I have never seen so many people so proud to say that they're atheists in my entire mm -hmm. life in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. We're making Pope jokes. Mm -hmm. We're at the mm -hmm. age of making Pope mm -hmm. jokes. This is if this is the annus horribilis, no pun intended, mm -hmm. of <laughs> of the Catholic Church. This year would be it. Mm -hmm. And the mm -hmm. Philippines is the last bastion of where Catholicism is mm -hmm. sort sort of like the order of the day. Mm -hmm. If they lose the Philippines, they, it seems like they lost group in the entire mm -hmm. on the entire planet. Mm -hmm. Acting out lang yan. Kung, mm -hmm. kung pikon ka, you're in a low oh. moment, of course you're going to do something as stupid and idiotic and act out and <laughs> as like, putting up tarps like that and mm -hmm. trying to polarize using methods that are completely out of date. You believe in uh, there's such a thing as a Catholic vote? Um, I only have one name. No offense to you, man. JC De Los Reyes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
official endorsement of the Catholic Church in the 2010 election. Oh, yeah. That was the man. Vote JC De Los Reyes. Mm -hmm. And he got 44,000 votes. Mas wala yung pa followers po sa Twitter. Mm. <laughs> I, I, I'm not that. Mm. I was gonna say, <laughs> Megal mo lang yan mm. lunchtime. <laughs> the thing is, they just have to realize that they are irrelevant. Mm -hmm. They've become irrelevant. Mm -hmm. It's their fault that they are irrelevant, mm -hmm. right? And the reason why they're irrelevant is their a polarization of their tactics and they're just not keeping up to date. Mm -hmm. they, they've seriously gone badui. So they need to humble themselves, mm -hmm. I guess, and start acting like the way the rest of the world works. Mm -hmm. No one, information only went one way. Now with social media and all of these alternative, you mm -hmm. know, methods of information and communication, mm -hmm. the power does not come from one direction, but the power then comes from below, from the mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. And they don't realize that actually the Catholic Filipino people have more power than they do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now with the passing of the RH bill, it's proven mm -hmm. that the Filipino logic mm -hmm. and rational side mm -hmm. has superseded mm -hmm. our we we'll believe carte blanche with the Catholic Church is standing aside. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, hey, hey! Did Since then? Since then. How long did you Um, With a friend that died. Since 2010? Mm. Yeah, usually funerals, masses. Mm. On Sunday, I, I must admit, I do find other things that I think are more <laughs> beneficial to the universe mm. than going to a church mm -hmm. okay. and pretending. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I, mean, honest. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's too, I mean like, okay, I'm still Catholic. Mm. If a plane is okay, crashing, man. oh, mm. I mean like, really, I'm going to start praying to the spaghetti God. I'm going to hail Mary, man. I'm sorry. Oh. 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 That'll mm. be the fastest rosary you're ever going to say. <laughs> you, you, <laughs> you, you, <laughs> yeah, I like everything about the Catholic Church. You know, except for the part where they get bigoted and crazy. I like the architecture, I like mm -hmm. the music, mm -hmm. yeah. I like the, the art. The art. Mm -hmm. I like the, you know, the basic do unto others mm -hmm. what you want others to do unto mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. um, you know, that's all very cool. Mm -hmm. It's just when they get kind of weird about sex. Mm -hmm. It just gets kind of weird. And it's all about sex. They say it's too early mm -hmm. to teach a child sex education to sixth grade. Mm -hmm. Have you seen a pregnant fifth grader? Mm -hmm. uh, when he's pregnant fifth grader, then you're right too late. Mm -hmm. <laughs> correct, correct. Noon pa lang ba talaga interesado ka na sa history and mm -hmm. Satanism? <laughs> <laughs> Pero noon, kilala ko si Carlos uh -huh. Eldran, the painter. Mm -hmm. the Collage pa yan, ng trip mm. niya, collage. Yeah, oh, super trip, yeah. Mm. Ginagawa mo dati, mm. ngayon palang ginagawa ng iba. Mm. Alam mo ba kung tinuloy mo yung ginagawa mo, mahal na yung mga gawa mo. I don't even know hey, where they are. Mm. If there's anybody out there who has my paintings, please come mm. forward. Yeah, no? For in-house in house naman siya ngayon yeah, sa Silver Lens, di ba? The thing is, I like mm. painting and everything, but sobrang mm. introverted. It, mm. That is a recipe for mm. psychological disaster sometimes. Mm. Kaya ka gumaganda yung painting. Because you have to go into a room and you have to get into your soul and spirit. Then you have to purge all of your... You have to do what it takes, alcohol and mm. all other additives. My drama now became from being inside the room with all of the collages mm. and the painting. Mm. Sobrang mm. labas naman. Now, labas naman. Labas naman. And oh. then you put Mabot, it out Mabot there. Mabot simbahan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, it's gotten me off. It's, it's actually helped me get off drugs, oh. actually. I used to be kind oh. of wild. Mm. And Dapat hindi mo sinabi. Sasabihin na ngayon. Sabihin is mo nga pare. <laughs> ah, Ay, sinasabi na nga ba? Uh, ah, kaya pala, nag-drugs na dati. Ah, but as, the, as Saint Augustine said, Lord, let me be good, just not now. Not yet. Oh. <laughs> so when I was my happy by St. Augustine moment. Hindi ba nakakain si St. Augustine? Parang he got to enjoy his life. Tsaka siya bigl mm. biglang na ganun. Hindi ba nakakainis? But he had metanoia. Aha, aha, right? Aha. He had, this, he had that, that, the, the metanoia mm. means a sudden change mm. of your attitude. When I got into performance art, that was my art metanoia. Ah, from going okay. inward to outward. Mm -hmm. And it actually helped me cleanse, get off drugs, clean mm -hmm. my life. Because mm -hmm. to deal with people on a daily basis, I mean mm -hmm. from television mm -hmm. you know this, you have to be somewhat sober mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. and maintain a level of manageable sobriety mm -hmm. when dealing with other human beings. Mm -hmm. So that tour actually helped me mm -hmm. kind of get out and talk into the world. So, mm -hmm. yung bahay eh, sa 13, yung Mabini Street, di ba? Yun ang bahay ng Tesoro. It, oh. It's a gallery there. I just work for them lang. I just work for them lang. So, so siya doon ka, ka magpe-perform din. Minsan, may mga workshop. I'm helping them find performance artists. Mm -hmm. Parang ako yung performance curator nila. At may mga KTV malapit doon. Malapit. Mas sa harap. Oh. Ang ermita kaysa oh. sa Malate. For sure. Correct, correct, correct. Something about Malate just took some weird turn towards Baduy and never came home. Because the reason why, okay, oh. this is the reason why I think why Malate is going
going down because you're only competing with two things, either kimchi or pechai. Because it's now the Korean tourism paradise and prostitution mm. paradise. The, the mayors have to do something about this mm. because if you're only polarizing your economic brackets mm -hmm. or your economic activities, mm -hmm. Because if I'm opening a restaurant that serves hamburger, mm. okay, neighbor is selling pechai. Mm. Pechai is easy to sell in that mm. neighborhood mm. and it can rake you in at least 100,000 pesos mm. a night. How many hamburgers do I have to sell to mm. compete with that mm. pechai? Mm. So now it just only become, it just becomes a monotonous sort of thing, mm. which just becomes only mm. pechai mm. stations, mm -hmm. so to speak, mm -hmm. and not a varied economic mm. bracket with restaurants. So and, and that's all about it. Uh. Prostitution is what killed him. Malat. Naglalakad ako sa Intramuros. Parang si Carlos Andran yun. Anong ginagawa niya? Naghanap ako ng camera sa likod. Mm. Nakala ko may shoot. Oh. Pero may mga white people siya, mga limang white people. Kaharap niya. It's theater. It's street theater. It's busking. It's performance art. That's why it's not really a, a tour. Tour guides get mad. Mm. An ano yung sinasabi ng mga tao about your ML? We've been trying as much as we can to erase the Marcoses from our history because of some sort of national shame. When in reality, the influences that they've had on our society are so impervious, mm. are so inclined, mm. that it's almost trying to erase an elephant in the middle of a room, mm. you know? Mm. So it's not like I'm trying to raise them up. Mm. All I'm trying to do is create a balanced playing field. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, these people are so far in history, the Aquinos and the Marcos mm. says, for some of these kids nowadays, that's like mm. talking about magsaysay, it's mm. like talking about queso, it's Correct. like, sino ba sila? Correct. You know? Mm -hmm. What I'm trying to do with the email the tour is just present two sides mm -hmm. and then it's up to everybody else to choose. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know? And then people think I'm apologizing simply because nobody's ever heard mm -hmm. the Marcos side. Mm -hmm. Anong tingin mo sa nangyari sa Saba? I don't know why people die over land, but I just wish we lived in an age mm -hmm. where contracts that were written by people who are not from our land. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm shaking things up and messing things around mm -hmm. are actually resulting in the deaths of people who should really be more unified. Because mm -hmm. swear to God, people of Sulu are probably closer in mm -hmm. culture, religion, mm -hmm. mentality, mm -hmm. and genetics mm -hmm. to the people of Malaysia mm -hmm. than to us retards from Manila. Mm -hmm. I mean, seriously, they mm -hmm. shouldn't be fighting. Mm -hmm. If we give up on Sulu, then we'll be giving mm -hmm. our sovereignty. Mm -hmm. But if we fight for Sulu, then we're going to screw up the MNLF. Mm -hmm. This issue of Sulu has been there since forever and ever. Mm -hmm. Amen. That, that treaty written by Britain. I don't know, it's kind of unfortunate because that guy, mm -hmm. it, the, the British really screwed it up more mm -hmm. than anybody else. Hanggang sa, kahit sa ano, no? I mean, this is a good example to create a small example mm -hmm. of the ASEAN state. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right? So, get Malaysia, Philippines mm. on board. Look, we don't want to give this up, but we mm. also can see mm. the obvious and we live together. Mm. What things do you need from one another? Mm. Do you need water from us? Do you mm. need arms from us? Mm. Do you need food from us? If we break up, mm. so to speak, mm. how will be the division of goods? Mm. And if we choose to stay together, how do we do conjugal ownership? Mm. You know, how do we do some sort of like, you know, when parents divorce, how do you mm. take care of the child? Pagdating sa Philippine history, ano yung mga specialty mo? Ano yung mga weak points mo? The Islamic part of our history. Ah, okay. okay. I'm, I'm very weak when it comes to Mindanao. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, my strength, World War II in Manila. Mm -hmm. And the 1972, mm -hmm. probably World War II more than the 1970s. Mm -hmm. Pero bakit World War II at martial law? Well, World War II, I, I think, very important because it's the most forgotten part of our history, mm -hmm. especially in Manila. When World War II, <coughs> can fully explain why Manila looks like Mm -hmm. Right, We had the most beautiful city mm -hmm. in all of the Southeast Asian mm -hmm. corridor. We had the most technologically advanced public mm -hmm. transportation mm -hmm. system. We had the first airline, first beer, first everything. Mm -hmm. Manila was gorgeous. Mm -hmm. And then between the Japanese and the Americans, they both decided to fight one another in World mm -hmm. War II. And they fought it in the city of Manila. Mm -hmm. Basically, this wasn't our war. Mm -hmm. And because of the destruction of Manila, we lost Intramuros, mm -hmm. which is probably the seat of all of our cultural artifacts. Mm -hmm. We lost major city planning, mm -hmm. and we psychologically damaged three generations. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's why after Manila was destroyed, all of a sudden there's migration to Makati, migration to the new Intramuros mm -hmm. of Forbes Park. Mm -hmm. Everybody started going to Merville. You know, all of a sudden, Manila became this closed hated, threatening city, mm -hmm. as opposed to the wonderful city mm -hmm. that it was before mm -hmm. World War II. It became a Lino Broca movie. Mm -hmm. It became a Lino Broca movie mm -hmm. from a beautiful 1920s mm -hmm. postcard, mm -hmm. right? And people forget that that's why we look like hell. People think like, oh, we're going to start looking like hell because that's just in our nature. Mm -hmm. 
No. Manila look like hell because we're still suffering an urban psychological trauma. Mm -hmm. Cities can be psychologically damaged. Mm -hmm. And that's why Manila looks like hell. Mm -hmm. And you go to other cities like Cebu, mm -hmm. you know, why isn't there that why is there this lack of a Lino Broca mm -hmm. attitude about it? World War II brought that Lino Broca attitude mm -hmm. in it. Mm -hmm. Not Lino Broca himself, and it wasn't the Marcos mm -hmm. says. Because martial law, no matter what you may say, that was the greatest moment in our attempt to fix Manila, mm -hmm. creating the MMDA, creating mm -hmm. this psychotic thing called the Human Settlements Commission. Mitch, oh yeah. Okay, you know, whatever. Yeah, it was, <laughs> whoa, mm -hmm. esoteric. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? <laughs> Maslow hierarchy of needs. You make yeah. you make sense. NHA, uh -huh. the nabuing NHA. Yeah, uh -huh. I don't just give them things. Give uh -huh. them beautiful things. Uh -huh. But sadly, everything got perverted in the very end. Mm -hmm. So I like talking about martial law because mm -hmm. it was our attempt to correct that 87th Constitution. Constitution is the reason why we are poor mm -hmm. and all of these people are crying boogeyman oh you change the constitution mm -hmm. you're gonna get a dictator like marcus mm -hmm. again <laughs> and it's not true you have to change the constitution and modernize it in order to bring the philippines into the 21st century mm -hmm. term extension, yeah, term extension oh. and that's not true the term extension you can we can do a constitution correction without even touching mm -hmm. that okay mm -hmm. number one thing we have to do is loosen our economic restrictions mm -hmm. to foreign investment mm -hmm. We're only running on the steam of the oligarchs. Mm. And that's why 11 people are on the billionaire's list mm. in the Philippines. Mm. But yet, we're still 60% poor. Correct, mm. correct. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, hey, hey! Mas gusto mo ba na may mga coffee shops, may mga bars? Yung ginawa dati nila. Or may mga taong grasang nakatambay doon at pinamasahe siya. Coffee shop and bars. I mean, what do you do? Of course. Oh, actually, I don't mind a little bit between the two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't take it away from that. You just have to make sure that there's a good mix. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not for ghettoization, whether it be for poor or for rich. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's why I like living in the East Village in mm -hmm. New York, because you had the rich and the poor, mm -hmm. like, mm -hmm. all together mm -hmm. in one. Yung problema lang sa Manila, masama ang business climate. Especially mm. peace and order, safety and cleanliness, mm -hmm. you know? And dealing with business and taxes. Mm -hmm. right? Ano ginawa din ni ano, ano, Mayor Achenza doon, ha? Oh, okay yeah, yun. but this uh, attitude towards birth control retarded. Mm. Oh. oh, you know, original yun. Ganda naman ilaw doon. Original na, whoa, no, hello. Yeah. But you know, in fairness, I'm, I'm really good friends with Kim, mm -hmm. and Mayor Tienz and I used to work together, oh. so despite our being on opposite sides, mm. I have nothing Sikia but Sikia nice Sikia. words to say to the man. Mm. I really have nothing but nice words to say to the man. May character bang Quezon City? Yeah! Mm -hmm. yeah. Quezon City is the coolest place in Manila right now, I have to say. Ang dami mga cute little neighborhoods like Matahimik Street. Ah, okay. You know, well, Matahimik Street is becoming mm. what Malate was back mm. in the 1980s mm -hmm. and 90s. Mm -hmm. Chef, ano, you know? interview tayo doon, di ba? Mas malinis ngayon ang Quezon City Circle. May mm. attempt ng mga puting overpass and underpass. Mm. May, may landscaping sa gitna ng kalya. Mm -hmm. Okay, kulay dilaw. Pero at least, you know, <laughs> at least may bulaklak pa rin, mm -hmm. you know. May I mean, SB. Even whatever it's SB, at least it's malinis naman ang tapat, uh, you know? So, I will give Belmonte and Bistec credit mm -hmm. for creating a, a really, really, a, a city where actually you can feel that it's changing for the better. Mm -hmm. More mm -hmm. than changing for the worse as the minutes go on. Mm -hmm. Like Danta, Manila. Ano ang favorite Manila place mo sa Manila? It used to be San Agustin Church, pero bawal na ako. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> pero bakit mo siya favorite? It's really nice in there, mm. quiet, peaceful. It's a garden inside. It's a garden inside. Tour it's just, like tour after I tour there, I would just stay there over lunch and just, you know, they close the doors and they lock the doors and I'd stay inside for one hour. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'd basically nap, mm -hmm. walk around, take a mm -hmm. snack, sit, look at all the paintings on mm -hmm. the ceiling, wander about, mm -hmm. you know. Um, Nakakain ka na baro sa katapat na restaurant? Sa Vista de la Mitre? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah of course. The nuns love me there. Ayan. Mm -hmm. And they get their. Mm -hmm. Atigit sa lahat, may alak. May alak. Oh. Ibir sila. Of, of course. Or wine. Of course. It's a priest, of course. <laughs> They're priests. They drink. Ano pinaka masarap na pagkain doon sa menu nun? I like their salpicao. Mura, 70 pesos. Oh. Malambot. Malambot. Mm. And there's peppers and everything like mm. that. It's really cheap because the, the money mm. goes to charity. Mm. You know? At ang mga waiters ay... Mm -mm. At ang mga mad... At ang, ang, ang mga kusinera ay... Mm. Mga mana madre. Mga madre. Yeah, <laughs> 
sayang. Ang galing-galing ni Carlos, oh. Mamimiss ko pag makulong siya. Oo. Oh, sige. Dadalawin natin yan. Dadalawin natin yan, tapos makikinig lang din tayo. Oo. Oh, yan. Masarap pa, Ben. Masarap pa. Gaya ng payo natin, ha. Ingat ka lang. Pag nagsashower ka, sa loob ng karsel. Oo. Huwag pupulot ng sabon. No, what was the word I do? When you go inside, you have to really beat them. You have to shank them. You have to beat them up the second you arrive. Ganun ba yan? The first day you go into jail, you have to beat somebody up. Or, or kill them. Or, or, ano, sabon, to, hulog. or just to, or, or you be the one uh, to get that person so because you have to, you sort of have to impose your power. Uh, parang aso lang. Oh, parang ayaw agad rin. Pero sana ano, makita din ng iba yung paano mo ginagawa yung mga tours. CarlosSeldon.com uh, uh, Yung mga ordinary people, paano ka nila, gusto nila, kung gusto nila sumama sa tour, ganun. It's every weekend, mm -hmm. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Wednesday, May Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Fee, ba ba? Uh, there's fee. Oh, it's a thousand pesos. Uh, it's five hundred. Hmm? Mm -hmm. That's a whisk up. <laughs> wow. No, my taxes are the most insane. I have to say this, man. Mm -hmm. Kim Harris, man, you're getting a lot from me. Um, <laughs> because I'm in a district where there's a lot of Hindi pwedeng declare. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do I declare a pedicab drive for a tourist? How do I declare oh, a Calesta driver mm. tourist? And all of the tickets for our national museums are not battable. Oh, mm. So, if only the Philippine government, dear government, mm. please make all of our national landmark sites tickets mm. battable. Mm. Because that way I can start declaring it. Because mm. apparently it's not. Mm. Right? And find a way to get Calesta drivers. So, my take home is very small because most of the tickets that I do goes to the institutions mm. that I'm going to. Mm. And and I can't declare it. Mm -hmm. Sucks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you can't afford, just stay posted. I do what's called a barter tour. Mm -hmm. Kung kulang mga tao, especially kung kulang mga Pilipino, mm -hmm. kailangan ko mga Pilipino mm -hmm. in a tour. Mm -hmm. If there's no Filipinos, I really can't do my tour. Mm -hmm. Because may question and answer, may, panang may audience mm -hmm. interaction. Mm -hmm. And kung puro foreigner, uh, they don't get my jokes, mm -hmm. right? So I need a couple of Pinoys in mm -hmm. the tour. So I put out what's called a barter tour. Mm -hmm. Mm. And okay, you can come to my tour. Is sa CrossFit ba barter yon? Is sa CrossFit training mo? Yeah, I gave him, I gave Meg a couple of barter <laughs> tours. So Tanner <laughs> and all the other guys came on the tour. Um, so they can come to tour and you can exchange a tour for any service, any uh, service mm -hmm. or object. Mm -hmm. Lumang lumang libro, mm -hmm. ensaymada, mm -hmm. galantina. Mm -hmm. uh, Basa yung a dozen mm -hmm. eggs. Yung yung fiduciary equivalent. No, 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 it doesn't have to be. It has to be just whatever object you want. Ah. So I've received isang mentos. Tuk. I've received... Ang loop. Parang like isang a nagbigay? box of cookies na nabawas ng cookie. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Sino naman walang hiyang nagbigay sa'yo ng mentos? I don't know. It's just on the table after I'm done. So I'm ah, like, ilalagay lang doon. Yeah, just put on the table, right? So I guess, sabi ko, just, just salvay, guys. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Pero masakit yung cookie nabawas na. Yung box of cookies. Yung masakit. <laughs> Uy. Ang <laughs> galing. Kuling tanong. Ayan, may tanong si Jun sa'yo. Okay, ko na. So, kunyari, you'll die tomorrow. What would be your last meal and why? My last meal and why? Okay, let me think. Uh, 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 uh. While you're thinking of that, what would you want to be played in your funeral? What music? Wow. Played in your funeral? I, I was just, I don't know why. Okay, I'm just doing everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Sort of like... Yep. What you call the free association? Uh, so I didn't think mm -hmm. of anything, and I don't know why I'm even answering this. Okay, number I, w I want the prichon, mm -hmm. and I want to eat the whole prichon. Mm -hmm. Like I will try to eat the whole, the whole. fried lechon. Mm -hmm. So that perhaps if the day before I die, I'll die one day before uh -huh. I die, because mm -hmm. I'm going to die the next day anyway. Uh -huh. So I'm going to have the prichon. Number two, I don't know why I think of the soundtrack of Pippin. Mm -hmm. eh? Talaga? I don't know why. I did, we, uh, ah, free association eh. <laughs> Pippin, Pichin. <laughs> Pichon. Magic pero, to do. Pero Specifically, magic to do. Uh, And I don't know why. <laughs> Pichon na walang kanin. Pichon, pero may mentos. Oh. Baka I want, maybe it's because I want Bob Fosse dancers at my funeral. Ah. That probably could be the reason why I thought of Pippin. Ang I don't know why I thought of Pippin. Mm. All that jazz, siya yun, siya yun. Alright, maraming maraming yeah. salamat siyo. Carlos Seldran, mga kapatid. Yeah. Okay. Kaya hindi ka na magtalong dito. Salamat, salamat. Kailubo kasi ako. Salamat.